Now available from New Line Home Video. What's the costume? He's Don Juan. Do you understand why we're here, young man? I signed a paper saying they could keep you here to try to help you. It was slow. I knew she wouldn't go for me the way that I was. I had been reading a book. I decided to become Don Juan so that I could get some attention. I am Don Juan. You're right. Come on, man. Buenos dias, El Capitan. Buenos dias, El Capitan. When do you intend to start Don Juan on medication? Officially, in his hacienda, there are more nurses on Valium than patients. I mean no offense, but where physical law is concerned, you have the substance of fog. <laughs> if I give him medication, I'm never going to get into this world that he's in, and it's a wonderful world. Women are the closest a man will ever get to God, and sex is the ultimate form of worship. I've been feeding this kid since he's Don Juan. Who is he really? I don't know. What is worth living for and what is worth dying for? Only love. I lost the only woman I had ever loved. Now you understand why I must die. Who are you saving? Him? Or you? What is going on? You've been funny lately. He's getting to me. I've come to realize that after 30 years of marriage, I'm in love with my wife. Have you never met a woman who inspires you to love until your every sense is filled with her? You need me for a transfusion. It is only in my world that you can breathe. He is not Don Juan. How do you know he's not Don Juan? and teachers telling you what to do. You have movies, TV, and magazines telling you what to do, but you know what you have to do. Hi, believe it or not, this is Howard Harry. So who is he? Let's see, who do we have out there tonight, huh? They say this is where the reception is the coolest. There's nothing to do anymore. Everything decent's been done. All the great themes have been used up, turned into theme parks. He does it from his basement every night. Are you listening to this? They think you got attitude? You show them some real attitude. Make them wish that they never met. Third take this week. Feeling screwed up in a screwed up place and screwed up time does not mean that you're screwed up. If you catch my drift. So you are him. They say that I am Duluth, Dement, Durant. He's trying to tell you that there's something wrong. Well, guess what I say? Don't oh, be You want to spin for You know you're in there. Open the door. On my way. Yeah, I don't know anything about these letters asking for love advice. I mean, if I knew anything about love, I would be out there making it instead of sitting in here talking to you guys. Are we going to allow this guy to be heard by anyone who can turn a dial? I say we go after this. Personally, I hope that we get to hear him a little bit before they nab him. Steady control. Don't you see? You're the voice you're waiting for. Well, it's about time. I'm calling for every kid to seize the air. Feel it. Find your voice and use it. Christian Slater in the card. Pump up the volume. Picture this. You're lying on a deserted beach. Sun feels good. Now reach over to that drink beside you and take out an ice cube. Take the ice and okay. run it down your neck. Oh. Listen, honey, um, go grab go grab another ice cube, okay? No. 
Joe loves his job. So what, you dumping me? I need to figure a few things out. Where, where are you gonna go? I have to go. No, Ellen, wait! I'm not gonna get through this. I can't imagine my life without her. Connie hires Joe. I'm Joe Casella. Are you good with women? Are you good with your job? I know women. You get Ellen back for me. Excuse me? You can break her heart and send her running back to me. Is that you? Yeah, why? Because it looks a little like Axl Rose. Joe, you're so sweet. Joe goes to work. So did you find her? Right on the schedule. I don't know anything about you. You cook like a chef. You look like a movie star or something. I'm a male escort, and somebody hired me to show you a good time. <laughs> yeah. She ate it up. Things get complicated. I just want to tell you, I think you, know, I think you got a lot of style. You, know, you make my heart stop. The two of you are like friends now or something? I know what I'm doing. Can you stay with me. I spent the night with a guy. How dare you? I can't do this anymore. I trusted you. Who are you? Tell the truth. Ellen! William Baldwin, Kelly Lynch, Cheryl and Finn, Three of Hearts, directed by Yurik Boygovich. It's just another girl meets girl, girl loses girl, girl hires boy to get girl backstory with a twist. Ellen! Well, that was impressive. I could have caught that cab in heels. From E.M. Forster, author of A Room with a View, comes a film about a love affair. Lilia is engaged to be married. Don't cry, dear. That was never meant to be. She's been seduced by a country, not by a peasant. But we can only judge a country by its men. Merry women, do not wonder about her love. <laughs> but I'm older than you, and I should lose her hug. I am your husband. And I've got the money. I thought Gina was splendid and young and if they wanted to get married, why shouldn't they? Nothing could come between Lydia and her lover. That man will either marry her or murder her. Except her in-laws. Welcome to Monteriano. Oh, poverina. Oh, leave me alone. I don't care for the lot of you. I'm English. There is going to be such a row in this town that you and he will be sorry you ever came to it. You are comfortable this way. For nothing. He's assaulted me. Can you believe it? In my own room. Helen Mirren. Helena Barnum Carter. Rupert Graves. Giovanni Guadelli. And Judy Davis. If he asked me, I would have given myself body and soul. In a story of lovers. Because he was unfaithful to his wife doesn't follow that in every way he's absolutely violent. It is the supreme test. Who dared to rush in. I do so wish something would happen to you. I know this may be painful for you, but I'm here to rescue you. <laughs> Where angels fear to tread. And now, our feature presentation.